Legend of Total War here with part 39 of my Stainless Steel 6.4 Let's Play campaign as the Quaresmian Empire. On the last episode, I fought a bunch of battles uh, near Jerusalem and conquered Jerusalem using a force draw out technique. Now, next thing to do is to use the new Shahzade. How old are you? 21, whatever, War Council member, to take out this army. And that clears out quite a significant amount of this area. Oh, okay. Um, the Crusader states are still over here in Karak, so these guys haven't done a very good job at clearing out the Crusaders. But that's okay, I'll finish their job. As soon as I've killed them, that is. One to one ratio. You have no command yet. Piece of shit. So what am I up against? I have a severe lack of archers. Could be really helpful on this one, because they've got Mamluks. I don't have great cavalry either. All I've got is shit. Okay. It's, uh, this battle's probably not going to go fantastically well. Like, I don't think I'm going to walk out of here with, like, less than 100 casualties. It's probably going to cost me five, six, to maybe even 900 men, just because of all my low-grade troops and because they have some pretty high-quality units. But victory, I think, is pretty much assured. come to me, I don't need to worry about that, I'm pretty sure. Now you guys stand behind, and then you behind them still. I'd rather these guys don't go forward until the, um, the Mamluks have been dealt with. Once the Mamluks have been dealt with, then, shit, what are they doing? Didn't expect this. Where are they going? Are they reforming? The fucks. Ah, shit. Need this high ground here. Fuck, they're shooting me over here as well. Pricks. I didn't expect this one to go fantastically well, and in all honesty, I could use a more professional army. One that has more archers. More better quality archers. These archer militia shit, they don't count for crap. Fuck, gotta reposition. It's taking too long. Okay, you guys need to go forward now. No point sending my cavalry up against their Mamluks. Uh, they'll just run away. Come on, you guys, get into position and start shooting. We're losing. Shoot the Mamluk archers, specifically. And that's the general's unit. out those fucking Mamluks. We outnumber them, so that's a little bit of an advantage, but of course, they're just better quality fucking troops. Piece of shit! My guys aren't fucking in range. Or well, weren't quite in range. Their general's coming forward, that's good. Get rid of that prick. My guys are getting decimated by just a handful of them. You guys, fucking well, go forward. I'm not gonna win this without you. Even if, even if uh, my whole army is destroyed, if it's a trade-off, that you know is acceptable as far as I'm concerned. At least it gets rid of these guys out of my land. I can raise armies a lot faster than they can now. I think. Even though my army's a shit house.
Fuck, what are they doing? Take the fight to them and win this. Because those mamluks are going. Four fights with horns made of clay. We are winning the battle. The fuck are they doing? Let's crash right into their fucking flank there. Can't say if that was a good idea, but it was an idea. Light piece of shit troop. You run them down. Fuck you, doing? get over here. What are you doing? Get over here. Come on, we need to smash into them. You guys smash into there. What are you doing? Take out those mamluks. I didn't realize they weren't finished yet. Surrounding them. How are we going for kills? Oh, this has actually gone a lot better than I thought it would. Oh shit, I didn't know they were there. No wonder my, my guys were getting slaughtered. I haven't killed the enemy general yet either. Be him there. Right, close in around this here. We've, we've got these lot completely surrounded. So let's break them. That way we can move them onto other things. What a mess. Yeah, now I'm starting to take the sort of casualties I thought I would be. But, at the same time, they're losing a lot more than I am. A lot more. Come on, bloody, we'll break them. Only half the enemy force remains. We must pray they lose their will to fight. Yeah, yep, smashing them. What are you doing? Smash them. What's going on here? What are you, what's fighting you? Yeah, don't be fighting them. guys are all about to break. Uh, my Persian spearmen took the brunt of the fucking attack, but they held these guys back long enough for me to come over here and break them. Enemy flees before Perfect. Us like a of so all I need to do is make sure I, I kill 85% of the army, and we're sweet to go. My army's still intact, which is more than I expected out of it. I only lost a quarter of them, of which some will actually recover as well. Make sure we're killing as many of them as possible. Gotta get to that sweet spot, 85%, which I've done now. Might just do kill a little bit more just to make doubly sure that these guys do not fucking come back. That ought to do it. Ha! <laughs> Half their army was captured. The enemy must curse the day they were born. Let all the poets write of this most wondrous triumph. 600 lost. Not, not too bad. So that is a little bit less than a quarter of my army. I mean, the army was garbage, so it's not a big deal.
point is, I'm putting a lot of pressure on the Fatimids, and they're soon to get fucked. Long live the warriors of Islam! First new major victory, promising commander. Well, that's useful. Should we spend the turn in Damascus? With no, forget it. Sultan, order. How may I serve, Sultan? Okay, just see if I can tidy this up a little bit. Order. So I've lost one battalion. Sultan. Nearly another. That guy could use some retraining. And we'll continue going down south. As you will. But I'll also bring along them as replacements to those that died. Good. Yeah, that's fine. Well, those being my two main military um, armies, well, sorry, active aggression armies, then now I just need to see what else I can do to defend myself against the oncoming hordes of uh, Byzantines and Mongols, and then move on to the next turn. Because money's no longer a concern, as you can see. I've got heaps of money. How many regions do I have? 36, yeah, so I've got heaps of regions. Those Mongols have just been sitting there for bloody ages. Stupid idiots. I mean, I don't have a problem with it, but still. Same with them, they're just sitting there. Okay, and over here, these guys need to reposition over here. And we've got this mess over here that needs to be dealt with. So, firstly... Once I capture you, Sultan. How are we gonna get someone? Okay, so that's unmovable there. Can't get to there. Um Let's see, just put him there. Sultan. And you there. Yala, my Sultan wishes you dead. Piece of shit, fucking traitorous pricks. How may I serve? I don't know. Just give that a shot. As long as they're near my forts, I mean, it's just two of them. That makes it very irritating. I wonder what I that being said, first, he is only a general's bodyguard. Order. I do not know if this would work, but if I... I know that in manual resolve, I wouldn't stand a chance, but auto resolve... With all of these guys fighting him, and since it's just him, it might actually win. We shall end this day in there you go. Took a bit of a risk on that one. Yes, I think we will. And he's fucked around all the way over there to get around the other side. Perfect. Okay. Now you need to stand there. That's fantastic. You there. Infidels to kill, Sultan. How may I serve? You can stand Sultan? right there. And you yes. are going to build some more forts to make this even more difficult for them to get around. So two spaces in that direction. We move fort right here. Inshallah, the enemy will be foolish enough to attack here. We also need someone to protect him, of course. From enemy assassins, of which there will still probably be heaps. But I'm pretty happy with how that went. Order. How may I serve, this area still looks good, in my opinion. No, I mean, I could make some more forts, but this has been going on for 57 turns and it's worked just fine, so just don't break a good thing. Or don't, don't fix something that ain't fucking broke. And now I just spend the last of my money on uh, construction stuff. That'll never come of handy to me, but yeah, so no point constructing it. Won't be able to recruit anyone that I could get from there. It's all about money. 
The more money I have, the more garrison I can put into my frontier regions, uh, so I can protect them long enough for my main armies to continue to expand. Because that's the problem I'm going to face now, since I've only got two active armies that can be fielded in enemy territory, the wider my frontier, the harder it is to defend it all. So I'd need money to be able to uh, keep garrisons there. Alright, so here. Uh, just build that. That'll give a bit of public uh, population growth, actually. Let's dump the tax. Don't think we need huge tax rate, uh, tax rate there. Not overly important. Gorgon. Uh, yep, go with that. Good, upgrading that, that's very good. Everything else has got stuff being built, which is good. Uh, I can't build anything in Jerusalem, I just took it. And I've still got 86,000 left over, that's fucking, a, that's fucking great. Uh, we need another, another army ready to move out from here. What else do we need? I'm thinking heaps of these archers, they're fucking useful. Wouldn't mind some Ottoman infantry, but I'm not the Ottomans. And apart from that, that's fine. Just leave it at that. Alright, let's move on to the next turn. Nothing else to do. Oh, come on, you cumin pricks. Surely the uh, the Mongols are enough of a problem for you. Come and take me on. Fuckhead. Good, getting them out of here. So at this point in time, the only faction that's been destroyed is actually Turks. Sunset on today's journey. Leaving nothing for the infidels. Yeah, well, we knew they were coming. Actually, they were the Fed, uh, they were attacking the other region, so guess they gave up on it and decided to uh, attack Iconium, which is fine with me. I've got a pretty good garrison there. Can't let these Byzantines go on with this unchecked. I need to send send someone. Maybe as soon as my faction leader dies, whoever becomes the new faction heir should deal with the Byzantines with an army that's trained at Caesarea. Yes, because I need more family members. No, because if I don't have family members, I'll end up fucking getting elim uh, eliminated. So overall, the Golden Horde is on top, simply because they, of course, spam these fucking armies. But apart from that, I'm doing okay. Diplomat dies. Ah, you piece of shit anyway. Koomans are at war with me now. That's just fucking great. Over here. Continue to distract them. Bring them out of here. Same with this. Continue your distractions. And over here, they didn't move at all, so don't worry about it. And if they did, I'm ready to defend myself. Another fucking full stack. You've got to be fucking kidding me. Oh, they've just taken their uh, Kerak. Well, good on them. Piece of shit. Um, I'm a little bit skeptical about going after this. If it's mostly infantry, that's fine. I might go for a bit of a draw out. Just using my cavalry. 
I don't see any reason why not. That's provided there's not too much bloody shit in there. Like, if there's any Mamluks, then that's going to be hard. Got some desert cavalry as well. That's not really going to be that useful. Hmm. That one there needs to be taken out. And then we can move our way down this direction. Now I want to switch this over here. Whoops. Oh well. Well, easy come, easy go. Not a big deal. At least I can know that they're there now. That's that's actually okay because if I had sent men down here to besiege this, they could have come and stopped me, and then that my army would be fucked. What I'm thinking is I'll send this guy to destroy this army because it's experienced and, in all honesty, not as strong as this one. Then these guys should be able to attack Gaza unchecked for a draw out without this guy interfering, because this one can interfere. So, the fact that I got ambushed there is actually not a bad thing, all things considering right now. Uh, odds are in my favour. What am I up against? Still some Mamluks. It's not that tough. Let's do it. reform straight away, but that's fine. Don't think they've got artillery, so that is good. down those motherfucking Mamluks. What's this over here? Arab cavalry? That's fine, my guys. These guys here can deal with them. Yeah, that's it. Get rid of those fucking pieces of shit. took out half of them, but when they're in that Cantabrian circle or whatever the fuck it's called, it does make it hard to shoot them. Still, keep doing so. Oh, fuck. Wasn't paying attention. Forgot what I was doing here. I'm trying to shoot them. Oh, I just lost half my fucking battalion. That being said, they did get shot up a bit. Now they're gone. Shit, there's hardly any of them left. And... They're dead. Good. Into those Arab cavalry. Now for the general's bodyguard. That guy needs to be taken out. Okay. Let's get you guys behind here. Who's shooting at us? Ah, them. Yep, go after them. Come on, we need to focus on killing this general. As soon as bloody possible. We want to shoot him. He might be a faction here. Victory is 
well within our grasp. In time, our foe will surely see this and lose heart. Watch the U, General. Come back over here and smash them. Ah, oh, fuck. Pain enough attention over here. How are we going? Oh, they're getting... Not really shot up. Ah, oh, fuck's sake. That did not go very well. Still, I'm winning. How's this going? Yep, they're fighting them, but the Mamluks are probably going to win. What's that? Take out those archer militia. That's fine with me. so it's my own fucking fault. Yep, get rid of those Mamluks. My spear infantry will hold out a little while. Don't have to worry about that. It's not Rome 2 where the battles are over in a fucking second. Force remains. We must pray they lose their will to fight. Oh, no, I'm gonna catch them like that. Okay, back up you go. Smash into the back of those Arabs. Actually, those spear militia. Oh, come on. I thought I gave you some fucking orders. Look what they do. They just bloody plow right through. That's what I do. People call it an exploit. The fucking AI does the exact same thing. Dead. Piece of shit. How the fuck did they get back here so quickly? Yeah, just keep them distracted, Turkish archers, while we shoot the fucking general in the back. Good, we got those Mamluks. Too bad, all things considering. Yeah, get out of there. Alright. Come on. Those Mamluks are surely dead. Looks like there's only one left. going on here. Good, now they're dead. So smash into the back of those Saracen militia. Where'd that general's bodyguard go? There he is. Fucking shoot him. Right into the back of that. Don't know if that's going to break them though. Be good if it did. Ah, close. Not enough. Come on, there's only four left. You can bloody finish this off. Oh, great. They They've done that bloody stupid thing again. They run straight through my guys, killing everyone in their way. And I like doing that, but I hate when it's done to me. 
Especially when my fucking guys are so unresponsive. Yeah, getting a few, few enemies captured. Nearly killed the whole army. They haven't routed yet. It's because that general's so bloody good. He's got so much command. Two of them left. My army's not in great shape. Now, that's about a little bit less than half what it was at the beginning of the turn. Or the beginning of the last turn, I mean. All we have to do is kill that enemy general and we're done. Our enemy flees before us like done. Victories are like sweet nectar. Come, let us drink of the most rare and glorious fr Well, they lost a lot more than I did. Now, I captured that general. If he's a faction heir, he's just a family member. He's worth. He's not worth bloody ransoming off. No, don't bother with it. Best just ex execute. Good. Okay, well, we can Our add a few additions to this army now. How may I Send. Can we recruit those here? No. I don't think I can recruit these either. Here. Everything's getting a bit different. Well, I'll send yes. these guys. They won't go all the way, that's fine, it doesn't matter. How may I serve, Sultan? Sultan. Naam. They got smashed. Sultan. How may I serve, Sultan? Uh, Bedouins. Yeah, okay. <laughs> six. That's awesome. Send them there. Naam. Okay, so this army here still needs more troops. What am I going to bring in Our from here? Enemies will suffer. All of them. How sure. May I serve, Sultan? What else you got for me in here? That's it. Oh well, that'll do for now. Okay, and now the force draw out. Let's do it. It's not a force draw, it's just a sally out fucking battle, whatever. So we besiege this, the uh, the fortress yes, Sultan. with inferior troops, water. inferior army. We shall outside their walls. Fuck! Mamluks. The time come to strike, mighty Sultan. But that being said, they've got so much infantry that this definitely makes it worth giving it a shot. If I can use my heavy, uh, use my melee troops to get rid of this Mamluk archer. And then these guys to get rid of the uh, family member. That should be okay. I can certainly afford to hire some more mercenaries. Probably both of these would be fine. Because that gives me a grand total of eight units, somewhat diminished. And they have... Uh, ten. So they should definitely sally out. That's good. Alright, you... Uh, just wait there, actually. That way, that guy's blocked across the river. Can't attack Jerusalem. I will not waste words on you, infidel. You, you can be the Lord of Acre. All right, now we just cycle through the shit that needs to be done and move on to the next turn. Okay, so what do we need here? Probably need some more. What are they? Turkomans. Those are Turkomans. Yeah, I think four ought to do it. For the army. And then retrain these bitches. Except for you. You're a shit. You can die. Oh, hang on. What's what's in here? Yeah, whatever. I know that one's got less upkeep, but I can't be fucked. Okay. Well... That'll do then. 
That's not urgent. I've already dealt with this. Yep. And that's all fine. Oh, wait, what about this? Leave this land in I had better or I shall remove you. build up Kutaisi. Ah, oh, fuck off. These are bloody good um, upkeep units. Piece of shit. Cumin fuck. Or face the might of Islam. Leave this land infidel. Uh, I yes, we need more of them you. if we're going to defend this spot. Actually, we need a mixture. Maybe bring something from Trebizond over there as well. Those are useful. Those aren't. They're shit. These are good, fairly good troops. I will not waste words on you, infidel. Yeah, I don't bother with that one. Okay, so now I just need to cycle through, build the shit that needs to be built, move on to the next turn. Actually, I might just uh, build everything that needs to be built and then take another break. Uh, where's Yazd? Yep, that's good. Expanding. Expanding is good. Makes me more money. Which is what I need. I need tons of fucking money. Okay, that should really improve the trade. Yeah, by 700. That's great. Yeah, Jerusalem. It's not a huge income boost, but that's largely because I don't have a huge amount of ally borders. Once I take Gaza and Karak, because that's where the, war, uh, the roads are going, then that will have made a big difference, those extra roads. Okay, well, I'm happy to just end the turn, uh, not end the turn, end the video here, and take a break, and we'll come back to uh, this shit next time. So like and subscribe, part 40's next, and uh, don't forget to visit me on Facebook. See you next time.